In last week's video, I shared five of my favorite wearable fashion trends for 2021. And this week I have shopped my own wardrobe and styled each of these five trends in a lookbook style video for you. Before we begin the lookbook, if you are new here, hello, my name is Emily and I make fashion videos with an emphasis on conscious consumption and finding your personal style. If that sounds like something you like, then maybe you might want to subscribe. Subscribing and liking these videos really does help me to create more free content like this for you. And if you want to see more from me, you can follow me over on Instagram at Emily Elizabeth May. I share more daily outfits there and this and that from my personal life. Okay, let's get started with my 2021 fashion trends lookbook. So I'm starting off with something really casual. This is the type of casual comfy outfit I like to wear out to run errands. Something easy like this is what I try to throw on instead of my active wear. I'll always make the effort to loosely tuck my jumper in at the front of my jeans, as well as pop on some basic jewelry. The first 2021 fashion trend that this outfit incorporates is relaxed jeans. Obviously there are a lot of different outfit ideas you can do with relaxed jeans, as well as a lot of different styles of relaxed jeans. I personally go for a mid or high rise with a straight leg. I'm not so much into the baggy jeans yet, but I do appreciate the look. This next outfit on the screen incorporates two of the 2021 fashion trends that I spoke about in last week's video, and that is relaxed jeans and vintage shapes. I've used a really beautiful minimal gold chain from Comet Collective to style with this outfit and I decided to add black shoes and a handbag. I am using the three color rule in this outfit to bring it all together. This next outfit on the screen incorporates three of the 2021 fashion trends I spoke about in last week's video. They are vintage shapes, earthy tones, and a cinched in waist. I've just styled this outfit with simple ballet flats for an elegant look. In this next outfit, I am wearing another vintage shirt. Over the top, I am wearing a blazer and I'm going to cinch in the waist with a belt. The cinched in waistline is such an easy and affordable trend to replicate. I then decided to style this vintage shirt with some relaxed jeans. These jeans don't fit me great. I'm actually waiting to alter them. So I'm just holding them at the back. This shirt I have actually styled backwards as well, just for something different. I finished the look off with some strappy black heels and my vintage shearling jacket. Once again, this outfit is put together using the three color rule. The next outfit has two different variations, both using the cinched in waist fashion trend, as well as wearing earthy tones. For this next outfit, I decided to get a little creative. I started off with some shorts and knee-high boots. However, this outfit is still a little naked for me, so I added a coat. Now I could either tie the belt of this coat around my waist for that cinched in look, or I could remove it and try something different. I got this beautiful scarf that matched my outfit really well and hung it over my shoulders evenly. I then grabbed my thick belt and wrapped it around both the coat and the scarf. I then neatened up the middle to cover my top and voila. I love styling scarves in this way. It's such an easy way to change the look of an outfit completely. The next outfit I created was a simple earthy tone outfit. Like I said last week, I love wearing earthy tones. They make me feel really, really calm. Both of these pieces are linen, so they are also super breathable for warm summer days. Next up, I wanted to try styling a belt over a top. So I grabbed this slouchy mesh top and I styled it simply with black basics and threw my belt over the top. In all honesty, it probably would look better with darker black pants, but I like the idea of this outfit. Just putting the belt over the top is a really easy styling idea. The next outfit is a special piece that I recently bought secondhand and the fashion trend that this outfit has in it is large floral prints. Large floral prints were everywhere all over the most recent runways and I really love this trend. I also saw a lot of orange colors and 70s inspired outfits on the runways and this dress certainly fits the bill for that. I hope you enjoyed today's video. Please give it a like if you did and I'll see you next time. Oh, my ears are blocked. Oof.
Ugh. <laughs> I sound like I'm underwater. Do 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 do.